Dan Kroenke and his company had a tough week. They launched a hunting channel in the UK and immediately drew the ire of celebrities and political leaders. That sent a shockwave all the way back to the company's headquarters here in Denver. Jeff Todd live at the Pepsi Center tonight. Jeff, it was a show that featured an elephant hunt that outraged people. Tom, it all started with this app. It's called My Outdoor TV, and people pay so that they can watch shows about hunting and fishing. Well, apparently people in the UK don't really care for shows like that. It's reported celebrities like Ricky Gervais have come out against this app because one show showed humans hunting elephants and lions. The outrage from the UK was so loud, Stan Kroenke himself said that those shows need to be scrubbed from this app. Start your free trial today. Download the My Outdoor TV app now. When the My Outdoor TV app launched this week, the reaction in the UK was quick. I've had so many emails from fans saying that they're disgusted about this. Much of the ire has been from fans of the cronky owned team in London, Arsenal. Piers Morgan, Jeremy Corbyn, the, the leader of the Labour Party has come out and said that this is sick, this is horrible, why are we doing this? The outrage reached Colorado and fans of Cronky owned teams here late this week. Relatively shocking that people would be televising elephant hunts on, on any channel. The app is owned by Outdoor Sportsman's Group, which is based here and runs a variety of media around hunting and fishing and guns. In a statement, the company emphasized Cronky has a long history of conservation and preservation, the outdoor channels are not associated with Cronky sports teams, and the shows depict legal and fair chase practices. Jason McKenna says a statement isn't enough. It would be appreciated if he would respond to, to controversies himself occasionally um, of any kind, whether it's the performance of his team or whether it has to do with, uh, with animal rights and the decisions that he's made. Again, that's an app that people have to pay for in order to consume that content. But still, we saw some forums today where there are fans in the U.S. hoping to join the fans in the U.K. and say they will no longer support teams owned by the Cronkies. We're live in Denver. Jeff Todd, CBS 4 News.